Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to make a lyric edit easy in After Effects. Let's begin. Here I have a song I will be using and to find any lyrics, you can google the song name and find it easy. So here is the text and the first word from the song is right here. I will copy it and then let's go to AE. Now first I will play the video to find the moment where he says that words and then I will mark my layer. It started right from here. So let's select the clip now and mark it. To mark the layer, press asterisk on your keyboard. Since I don't want to add any effects or more layers on my main timeline, I will pre-compose that layer and will be editing right inside it. Make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and hit OK. Now double click on pre-composed layer to go inside and here we have the clip with a mark and we can begin adding the text, but first let's click on track camera and wait until analyzing is done. Once it's finished, I will select some points on the car, cause I want my text to be tracked with car. Now right click on selected points and select create null and camera. Let's grab a text tool now and paste text from the song we have copied. Make sure to enable 3D on text layer and then select track null and press P on a keyboard, copy track null's position and paste it on the text. Let's correct the text, scale it, reposition, rotate and do whatever it makes you happy. You can also go to the text settings here and change the color or fonts as well. Once you are done and satisfied with the results, we can animate the text. Scroll to the mark where the text starts from and then open text settings. Now click on animate here and select opacity. Change opacity to 0% and then I will slightly scroll back before he starts saying these words and then expand range selector. Click on start stopwatch icon and then scroll forward something like that, or make sure scroll there where the text ends, or I mean where the singer finishes the words, in my case it's here, so now bump up the start to 100% and we can check the animation. Looks nice, now I will add some effects on the text layer to make it look better. First effect will be a turbulent displace. Change complexity to 4 and then play around with the amount until it's cool to you. I think 17 looks good, and now I will add a glow effect, I will use a deep glow plugin. Looks nice, I like it. I think it's enough and the main part is done. Now we will need to create a camera layer and add other animations like zooming to the text, but before that, make sure to pre-compose these layers into one layer. Make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration is selected and then hit OK. Now create new camera layer. Change type to 2 node camera and preset to 35mm and then hit OK. Now enable 3D on pre-composed layer, and then press A on a keyboard, then hold shift and press P. Now make sure to scroll to the very beginning of a camera layer and click on point of interest and position stopwatch icons to create keyframes. Then scroll forward where the text starts to reveal something like that and grab a dolly cursor tool. Press C on a keyboard until you see it, or you can also grab a dolly tool from camera tools here and then slightly zoom into the text like that. Now I will grab a pan cursor tool to adjust the position. Press C until you see it, or again, you can grab it from camera tools here and reposition the camera to correct it just a little bit. Now scroll forward again before the text ends and with a dolly cursor tool zoom in again something like this. Finally go to the end of camera layer, or where the text is fully revealed and then right click on point of interest and position here and select reset to reset the camera settings. Now select all keyframes and hit F9 on a keyboard to easy ease them, then go to graph editor, right click here and select edit speed graph and then we will need to adjust the curve properly so the zooming speeds up right where the text starts to reveal. Scroll forward where the text starts to reveal and then make sure to make a curve like that. That curve means it will zoom in right where the text begins, let me show you it. Looks fine and now let's do the same, let's scroll forward and for example I will speed up zooming right here as well. Let's check it. Looks nice, text animation and camera zooming animation is synced as you see and that looks so satisfying. The last curve we can make smooth like that and then let's check it one more time. Everything is cool to me, just make sure to enable motion blur on pre-composed layer and we are done. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.